Moving on to Wapak and Van Wert out at Harmon Field. And hang on for this one. Van Wert off to a hot start. Aiden Pratt scrambling around, looking, buying time before he finds Maddox Crutchfield. And then Crutchfield picks up the 48. And then how about the yak? 48 yards of it, sorry, 52 yards of it for the touchdown. And Van Wert starts to scoring 7-0. Then later on in the first, it's Pratt to Crutchfield again this time. This was a little bit short of a touchdown, but it all means the same on the scoreboard. Now it is 13-0, Van Wert. They get it back, and then Brylon Parker punches in for the touchdown, and the Cougars go up 19-0. Uh-oh, it looks like Van Wert's going to pull away from this one, but Wapak not going away. Caleb Moyer in the third quarter, finding Grant Jolly wide open. Puts this one in for the touchdown. Wapak with some life. Now, four seconds left. Wapak blocks the punt. Jordan Snyder gets it and walks it in for the walk-off win for Wapak. They come all the way back, winning this one 20 to 19. You're going to have to wait until tomorrow morning to see this one in its entirety. Afterward, Garrett Seawright caught up with Travis Moyer, breathing a sigh of relief. It was for the third consecutive week when you needed a, a play from your defense, in this case special teams, you got it. What can you say about your crew to, to step up and make that final play to get you a victory here tonight? Well, it's just like we drew it up coming in tonight. <laughs> so, but uh, no, uh, just really credit our kids for making a great play in that situation, giving us an opportunity to win the football game. And I'm not sure who made the block. Obviously, we were selling out to block the punt, and uh, uh, fortunately for us, we were able to do that. And uh, obviously, Jordan made a great play at the end of it. What was the final message to your squad before the punt? And, and did you consider setting up a return and, and not sending anybody? No, obviously, we were in a situation we were going to go after it. We felt like that was our best chance. And uh, like I said, just fortunately for us, uh, you know, obviously, those are situations which we practice each and every day. And credit our kids for going out and executing it. You know, it's two weeks in a row. Uh, we've needed a block on special teams to get a job done and uh, it just shows you how important all three phases of the game are and that you got to execute in all three phases but uh, just really proud of our football program you know obviously we were able to fortunately weather the storm after the first quarter and kind of settled down and and just guys just played exceptionally well in the second half and really stepped up and just fought just fought for 48 minutes and it took every second tonight to win a football game